I'm, I, I'm gonna make them laugh here. I'm gonna say Merry Christmas, George. <laughs> Look at that on my film. Look at the snow. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Wow. Wow. Look at that. Merry Christmas, George. But I told her that you're, t uh oh, I need winter tires on my wheelchair. Yeah, yeah Merry Christmas, sir. Uh, yeah. That's. Yeah, that snow is something else. I was uh, uh, at South Health Campus and it just started and once I got back here, who oh boy. Wow. It's not sticky. Oh, this side of the house is 50 centimeters. Oh, thir Yep, 30 to 50 centimeters for BAM. Wow. High winds and everything. Oh, but if this continues at this pace, we'll have more. Yeah, hey, George. Yeah. We'll have more if this keeps snowing like this. No, but I mean, if it continues to snow at this pace. Are your glasses fogging up anymore at all? I wonder if he'll get stuck.
George, it started snowing like this around 4.30. Oh, okay. I was coming on the 14 Bible went back from South Health Campus, the 14. It really started to pick up by the time I was back to Somerset.
main highways, eh? Yeah. I already checked from Merbab. Are the plows even out yet or no?
You probably dealt with breakdowns and weather like this, right? Yeah, sure have. Even with the jimmies, I imagine. Yeah, that's right. What's the most common breakdown on the bus you had to deal with in the winter? Uh, probably the wiper. <sighs> but I mean any engine stuff or coolant? Mm -hmm. <laughs> The wipers are one of the worst things to break down in the winter. Because when you go back to the garage, well, I mean, they're in the garage, but back then you had to keep some outside. I've heard you had a bus fleet of a thousand buses, eh? It was actually bigger back then than it is now. You had 7,500. You had Jimmy's. You had NCI. You had these 01, 02, um, 02 new flowers. You had the 77, 78, 79s, 81s, 8,000s, 82s, and 83s. So that's a lot. What was the best bus to drive in the winter? In the winter, right? The 7500s weren't good in the winter, right? Yeah. So guess what? You what? know the day you had a sore throat, a bus broke down that day and is now retired. Oh wow. Eight eighty four is no longer in the uh, 8084 is no longer in the fleet. Okay. Caught fire. October 5th, 2020. Yeah. On Route 4, the bus caught fire. Oh, the okay. engine. You're welcome. One thing I don't like about uh, this, sir, you need to maintenance the buses more. I don't think once a year is enough, do you? No, right. Because 8084, 80, uh, its last day of service was October 5th, 2020, and they retired it in November. You've probably driven that bus, right? Right. Yeah, but it's gone now. Because the engine had too much fire damage. Yeah, that's it. Could they repair it if they wanted to, if the engine was all burnt up? Right. I never been on a snow ride with you. Oh, okay. No, right? This is the first time. Hey, um, hey, George? Since the engine is all burnt up, do you think it would be worth it for them to gut the whole thing and rebuild it? Uh, Too much money if it's burnt to hell from a fire, right? Not only that, it ties up a lot of people to work on it. Take the transmission out. Take the engine out that's burnt. Put a brand new one in. Or build one from scratch. I'm surprised a lot of these 77s haven't caught fire yet. But they, but they must put something in the engine um, that 
prevents the bus from catching fire. Improves the, you know. Yeah. They say the end, uh, the cause of a fire though is when the engine overheats too much. Oh, okay. Yeah, too, that's right. Too hot. Yeah. Did I tell you of that story once about the Jimmy? Oh. Yeah. Um, um, a guy, um, one of the drivers, um, I don't know when was this, but his brakes started walking up. He had no brakes. It was a Jimmy. And the supervisor asked him, can you get this to Whitehorn Station? And, and we did. But the thing is, when he got it to Whitehorn Station, the bus caught fire. Whoa! Because the brakes were cooked. How long ago was that? I don't know, but here's the story to it. The driver of the Jimmy, he noticed the brakes were starting to lock up. So on the way back to Whitehorn, he had no brakes. Whoa! Like he could stop the bus, but he had to hammer on the brakes. But the bad thing was uh, with that is they were locked, right? So to stop the bus, you had to hit them hard, and it was heating up the brakes more. Oh, okay. So and by the time we got to Whitehorn, bus went up in flames. Oh. Or a part of it. I don't know if it was total, but I heard it caught fire. Oh, okay. Then Jimmy's did that a lot, right? Yeah, that's true. Even though they didn't break down a lot, that was the one downside. Right. Is if you had something wrong and didn't know about it, catch fire. That's but they didn't break down a ton, but that was the one thing. Yeah. That was something when you told me when you said you ran out of diesel once. Yeah, on the roof. Uh, 13, right? Yeah, that's right, yeah. Right. Were you downtown at the time, right? Yeah, just outside of downtown. I would have been over on, uh, let's see, Lake Street. Yeah, Lake Street. Yeah, Lake Street. Yeah, Lake Street. Were you heading back to Mount Royal or no? I was coming in from downtown. And I just cleared the intersection. Is there anything different about Route 13 back then or did it go the same route like it does now? I don't know. I haven't been on it since about 95. It probably went some different ways when you were on it. Because not a lot of the communities it goes to now, like Sandy Beach Park, right? And Glenmore Aquatic Park, that wasn't developed back then. That's right. Early this morning, George, I was so overheated for some reason. Oh, okay. Just... The snow is very pretty, though. Yeah, it really is. We'll have a white Christmas. Yeah, that's Does Cliff like being out in the snow or no? What's that? Does Cliff like being out in the snow or no? Uh, well, he doesn't mind. Did you get your brakes 
today at all at Shaughnessy? No way. No. You might get one here or no? Uh, where are you going? Drive away? We're actually staying on for a whole nother trip. Oh, okay, good. Are you late? Is that why you haven't gotten your brakes? Covered the roads and cars within minutes. Okay? I hear the wind is supposed to get worse. The wind is supposed to pick up. How many passengers have you had on today? Yeah. Oh, that's really low. Well, that's what? Yeah. So you're finished in a couple hours, eh? I'm used to you finishing at 8. Yeah, that's right. But you're finished at what? 7.30 something? Okay. You put on millions of kilometers over the years, George, with driving the bus. Look at the traffic up there. Oh my God. Look at that, they're backed up. That's from shopping though, right? Yeah. Oh, you just made it across. Funny that joke at Fish Creek. I said Merry Christmas to you. Oh yeah. And you saw the snow coming down. Wow, that was pretty good. Hope you didn't mind me coming for an extra ride. No, not at all. I don't think I'll be coming out tomorrow. No, not a good idea. Just because of the weather. Well, that's right. That's going to take a lot longer to go anywhere with these kind of roads. And you know I would, but I don't... Right. Oh, and it's going to get worse overnight, eh? The oh, road... Yeah. <laughs> so I'm sorry I won't see it tomorrow. Well, that's okay. His car is covered. That's the blue one. That's our car, George. Yeah. Yes. 
Let me know when you're gonna have a break here. I'm gonna use the bathroom if you mind. Oh, you want to? If that's fine with you. Oh yeah. I only be a minute, a, a couple minutes. Right. I'm gonna run though because I don't want to make you late. There's no one on, right? Uh, yeah. Like in just run late and then make it up later. I'm sorry to ask you, but... Oh, that's okay. I don't know how flexible you are, so... I'll be back on the bus in a jiff. I'm just gonna hit the washroom and... Yeah, we, we can leave the ramp down if you want. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah. I just figured they say it's not good on your bladder, right? When you hold it in. No, not good at all. George, on Wednesday we'll take photos, eh? That sounds like a good idea. I was gonna do today, but the weather's too shitty, eh? I don't want to go out in that. No, that's right. What's it gonna be on Wednesday? I don't know. I, I know. think it's gonna be better than this. Hopefully. Look at the road. Yeah, Maybe you should go straight through the light from Fish Creek the next time. Yeah, I might. I'll see. Can you get back on route though, right? I'm sure you can. Yeah, I know. I know. Not too much of it. But I mean, you might have to do a detour, right? Well, that's a better thing to do anyway. Going uphill in this weather is the wrong thing to do. Well, it's a long hill. And like, you know what? It's rough on the tra transmission, so... Do you notice Route 14 is not busy? I noticed you're having to go a lot slower, right? Eh? Yeah, that's what I thought and stuff. You gotta be careful you don't get the speed up with the They say if you uh, get stuck and try to gun it out too, like if you're slow, ooh, yep, like that. Right. If you slide it can wreck the transmission if you gun it out. I saw pe people with buses do that and they say the transmission bridge when they're trying to go out there. Yeah. Jerry's probably late too, right? The other 12, Jerry? He's probably having the same issue. That's right. You're gonna be late tomorrow, I imagine. But I mean, if the weather is still shitty, right? Uh, I don't think it's so much the weather, it's the traffic. Yeah. And the roads, that plays a faster. You can't go as fast. Oh, your, that's right. Your normal speed. Right. Oh. George, you probably know what to do in weather like this. Well, you say, I'm gonna be late, so I can't really help it, right? That's right. You gonna take your break here means I'm going? Oh, uh, I can. Yeah. Well, we're gonna be like 10 minutes, but you know what? There's no one around there. Well, why these guys? They should have uh, done something else, right?
not enough room, eh? I think they were drunk. George, you drop your... George! No! Oh. oh yeah, thanks. Hi! Thanks for saying hi, I appreciate it. Have a nice evening. Thanks. I'm filming this snow, my viewers are like, that's a shake. Oh, you're filming the Christmas stuff. Have a nice evening. Yeah, you too. Thanks. Well, a Merry Christmas. Bad weather. Yeah, you too. Happy New Year. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Take her slow, don't fall. There's lots of ice. I can see the. Uh, is this the one? Yeah. It stays like this. Oh my god, tomorrow will be lots of snow. Have to make it fast, okay? Yeah. It's later than it. Yeah. Maybe if it's like this tomorrow, I'll get you to come on Wednesday when the yeah. weather's better. Just shoot me a text, okay? Yeah. Just let me know. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you. You're George. very welcome. Okay. 